Hello friends. Welcome back to my channel Calibration Academy. If you are new on this channel, and if you have missed our previous videos related to top 30 instrumentation questions and answers, you can find link in the description box to watch this video. And if you have not subscribed our channel yet, then please subscribe our channel, and press bell icon to get notifications, when we post video on the channel. In today's video, you will learn Where can we install differential pressure transmitter for flow measurement applications? And where can we install differential pressure transmitter for level measurement applications? So, please watch this video till the end. First of all, let's start with a situation, when differential pressure transmitter is installed on liquid lines. As you can see from the diagram that, for liquid lines, DP transmitter should be installed below the orifice plate. The reason behind is that, liquids has a property of self-draining. Now, let's take a situation when differential pressure transmitter is installed on gas lines. As you can see from diagram, for the gas lines, DP transmitter should be installed above the orifice plate. The reason behind is that, gases have a property of self-venting, and secondly at condensate formation. Now, let's take one more situation when differential pressure transmitter is installed on steam lines. As you can see, for a steam lines, DP transmitter should be installed below the orifice plate with condensate pots and both the pots should be installed at same level. Thank you. First of all, let's start with condition, when DP transmitter is installed for level measurement in open tank. As you can see from the diagram, when liquid level measurement is done in open tank, it is advisable to mount the measuring device below the lower measuring point, so that the impulse lines are always filled with liquid. And the low pressure side should be open to atmospheric pressure. In addition to this, the separator and drain valve is useful for capturing and removing sediment, when liquid level measurement is done in media with solid parts, such as dirty liquids. Let's take second scenario, when DP transmitter is installed to measure level in closed tank. As you can see in this situation, mount the measuring device below the lower measuring connection, so that the impulse lines are always filled with liquid and the low pressure side need to be connect above the maximum level. In addition to this, the separator and drain valves are useful for capturing and removing sediment, when liquid level measurement is done in media with solid parts, such as dirty liquids. Let's take third scenario, when DP transmitter installed to measure level closed tank with superimposed vapor. As you can see from diagram, in this condition, Mount the measuring device below the lower measuring connection, so that the impulse lines are always filled with liquid. In addition to this, low pressure side need to be connect above the maximum level. And the purpose of condensate trap is to ensure constant pressure on the low pressure side. Thank you friends for watching this video. I hope you like this video. And if you think our content is informative for you and others then please like and share this video with your friends.